Hello there, I am Giant Crow and welcome to my side series. I'm doing some tutorial videos. And this will be a long side series because I plan on making like a lot of tutorial videos if I can find the time to and find stuff that is actually worth doing a tutorial video on. So this one's pretty simple. I have Google Chrome up under here is my channel. Thank you guys for 2.33k subscribers. I really appreciate it. And to get the YouTube channel, if you don't know, you just have to click the little icon in the top right corner here. And go to your channel and boom, you went to your channel. Nice, okay. So, if you're wondering how I got these, uh, you know, playlists within the playlist kind of things, on my channel I'll show you guys how to do that. Like I got Pokemon, I got Mario, I got um, other projects, and then I got my, it's Steam Poison Side series. Which is pretty cool. So, to do that, I'm gonna walk you through on how to do it, and it's gonna be fun. So, customize channel, click on customize channel. And then he was like the old way out of YouTube before I made the dark theme, I guess. It's slightly different too, in the look of it. But, you want to scroll down to here, and you want to click this little crayon or pencil, whatever you want to call it. Click that. And you want to, under content, you want to pop the drop down menu or drop up menu, I guess, because it's up. <laughs> anyway, uh, <laughs> you want to go to playlists, and then you want to go to multiple playlists. You can make it horizontal, vertical. I prefer horizontal because uh, I just like I just like the, like the way it looks. How you scroll to the left or to the right some more. For example, if you push the arrow, you can scroll right to the more right to the right of the arrow, and it'll pull up and it'll go to the right for more playlists. If you haven't made the multiple playlists uh, setup, so for me, I just do horizontal real. I think it looks better too, honestly, in my opinion. Then you want to go to playlist selection and add playlist. And here's where the magic happens. Okay, so I got all the you can move around these playlists like so and so, but I like keeping them in the order of, I, of how I'm doing or how uh, the order of what uh, pro, what playlist I did a walkthrough or let's play on walkthrough guide or let's play on. So I put a uh, you know. Pokemon Bach is my current project right now, so it's like the newest, so it's the first to the left in the playlist. So that's pretty cool. So you can either find a playlist by pulling down the drop menu. And you get all, you get all your playlists really, which is nice. Or, you can enter the playlist URL. So for example, uh, I don't, let's uh, let's take a Pokemon to be for a second, just for example, okay. So if I go to my playlist, which I'm going to do right here, everyone's going to get a free shout out for the subscription box, yeah, okay. So you want to go to, uh, I guess we can go, click on the uh, top right corner on your icon, click it, and go to YouTube Studio. And I guess we can go to playlists. And let's see, my old Pokemon Ruby playlist is up here somewhere. It's the very bottom, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay. So you want to click on that, and then you'll have a playlist right here coming up. And you want to take this URL here. You want to copy it. Control C or can just right click and get copy. I'm just gonna right click and hit copy. Uh, so we don't need this anymore. We don't need this anymore. Okay. So after that, you want to Control V to paste or right click and hit paste, and you hit the add button. And it adds to the very bottom, to, to the very um bottom, I guess. So you have to, if it's like a recent playlist of yours that you're doing a project on, you want to click and drag and keep on dragging it to at the top of the playlist. But since this is my first walk the guide, it's obviously to the far right because my oldest lots uh, oldest I should say oldest project. So that's pretty cool. And after that, you want to hit done, and it should make changes right here. But to make sure, you want to. Finally, hit done again, and then it should save it. In fact, it does. If you go back to the right, I guess a couple of times, click to the right. Um, it's right there, which is pretty cool. And that's how to add a playlist within a playlist, as, as I like to call it. So I hope this video helped. Uh, I'm gonna go to my actual my channel now. And oh, I forgot to I forgot to shake um, I'll pause that. <laughs> okay. So, 
Yeah, you can also move them around which I'll show real quick because I forgot. I forgot to show that. Okay, so easily, easily wait to, um, you know, I forget to name it too. I try to name it. Okay. No, this is the right thing. It's live streams. Okay, we've got to add a post again. And you can add a title. Like, you can say Pokemon. Pro. Jacks. Pro Jets, yeah. And then you can hit done. And it changes the title. But for me, I want to change that actually because it looks funny. There we go. And hit done again when you're happy with the name. And hit done to save it. And to move them around, you just have to click these little arrows. So down goes down one, and up goes the up arrow goes up one. So you can rearrange them, which is pretty cool. I like having Pokemon them all than a projects inside series of Steel Plays. Or Steel Plays inside series. And notice that, I think that's all I have to, all I have to do. And hopefully this helps, like I said before. So let's pop the channel again. Quickly pause this. So that's cool. And uh, with that, you have your own personal in the playoffs, which is pretty nice. So yeah, so this has been Dragon Girl again. I'm the lead for, thank you for watching and goodbye. I'm to see you guys in my next tutorial video.